Fish, fish treadmill? Yeah. So I got to see this. We can put fish in here and we can generate different flows. And then using lasers and sensors, we can measure what their critical swimming velocity is. These are lasers right here? Yeah, lights. These are all different lights. But the idea here is we can swim them under different flow regimes and we can see like where different sized fish begin to, to um, slow down relatively. Check out these lasers. Where they get velocity. stressed, basically yeah. their endurance and all that? It's what you call it. Yeah. That's where all the samples and research is being done today. Guys, yeah, look at these big, beautiful green sturgeon. There's a big one right there. Here comes another one. I'm going to go over to one of the pens that have a little bit more activity. Right here behind the standpipe. Coming at you. Coming at you. Coming at you. To the left. Right there. Right in between your legs. There you go. Two more? Two more. Two more. Yeah. What the hell was being done? Santa. A big one and a little one. I think this is the male. There you go. Oh, that looks like a... Female went downhill in the man, yeah. yeah. Point to the one. No. Uh, about 154. Is that it? Male? Yep. Oh, I just wanted to show, show them the size of that fish. See, that's the big stripe that normally in wild fish is a lot more accentuated with white in here. Yeah. This would be that greenish yellow usually, like you see on the belly down yeah, here. I said that green stretch as well. That's the green one. That's the most distinct. Yeah, beautiful. beautiful. And the freckles, you know, the freckles. The white sturgeon occasionally get that. You guys oh, have always yeah. seen that. Yeah, yeah we do. Yeah. We call them beauty marks. <laughs> Virginia, this is one of the few days you're not the only chick <laughs> handling <know>. fish. <laughs> You've got girls handling fish today. <laughs> Incredible Hulk fish. That's the Hulk. Yeah, well, normally, see, this male spermiates like every fall. And usually it's pretty white, but this year it's pretty clear. <laughs> but, he, you know, he might either be at the end of spermiating or at the very beginning. Well, I think it was uh, inland fisheries. And their whole thing is landlocked ham and kokanee, you know, making inland fisheries lake better. Yeah. But, like, I liked it. You know, they're looking at it from the other side. Instead of being like, okay, catch and release, I'll, I'll lessen the impact of uh, human predation on this animal. They're, like, helping him out. And helping them thrive, yeah. you know. Whereas, like, we don't really, we don't really do much for these guys, you know. We're done. Yeah, that'd be cool. I'd like to see that before I croak. How small the rates are compared to the whites, or big compared to the whites. Yeah, the whites have tiny things. How mature are these eggs, though? They spawn this spring. She'll yeah. spawn this spring. If she has good egg quality, that's the thing. Sometimes we have females that are ready, but the egg quality is just not real good. And if we get any sort of spike in the water temperature, it gets hot, and will go what they call atriatic, and I'll start reabsorbing their eggs. It's like a shock. It's a mechanism to, to take the energy that's in the eggs and recycle it for the next. Yeah. That condition factor is a big thing. Yeah. Um, 
I really just want to show my mom how big she is. Put your hand by the other Yeah, looks like she's holding quite a bit. We like our fat fish. Go, what's the fecundity on a fish this size? Yeah, probably 100,000 100, maybe. Wow. Yeah. Fat proteins and vitamins. What? What's the whole thing? <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Hell look cute. I can't fit. I gotta. I gotta. <laughs> just a little. Uh, Here, Mike. So these are all white. We're, yeah. We're, we're holding them back because. Um, oh yeah. We're trying to slow their growth for research purposes. Oh. Open, open your hand and just let them run up. You can do that too. Right? I just want to look at them. Just open your hands big and hit, hit, let them. You can't go anywhere as a baby. Just put, yeah, let them do that. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put them in slow mo. We'll get a better look. So, reach in there and grab another. one last thing though. Um, in the wild, a fish of this size is how old approximately? This would be a young of the year fish. About a year old? Young of the year. Depending on the time of the year. So, young of the year, what does that mean? Three months, six months, a year? Young in the year is you got less than a year old. Less than a year old. You spawn at the beginning or the end of the spawning run. So there's the young of the year is what you are you. Isn't it? Right on. You can connect in. Yeah. I got a bigger mix in here. Yeah. Calm down. Yeah. I like how it's nose is keep pointing up. So cool. Yeah, it's so cool. There you go. <laughs> yeah, these, yeah. These guys look a little bit smaller. But there's some that are the same. So you can see, oh, you can see the look, look, at look at all the variation. Look at the Do they have any uh, theory on why surgeon jump? I know that's an age old question. They don't know, huh? No, we don't have a good answer to that. Yeah. A good one. Oh, cool. The babies are awesome. Yeah, I've never even seen one that one. Yeah, that one's missing a left. Which one? Yep. That one right there. Yeah. Look at this. I got it. You're just so cute. Yeah, get that little dude. Alright, keep him in the water. I want to get him in his natural state real quick. See how big his head is? That is the smallest. This I've ever seen. That's the smallest surgeon I've ever caught. <laughs> <laughs>